welcome to this video today I will show you how to get the PBSS PB emulator on your Mac uh, obviously it's on uh, on uh, Android on, and also on iOS and uh, on uh, Mac on, uh, and also on Windows so it's on all the on all the operation systems but um, if you just check on the the PBSS PB website if you go you can see that the installation or the setup of the BBSS PB on the Mac is actually somewhat difficult like you need to copy things to terminal and install things and something like that so I'll tell you an easy way to store it so first of all you need to go to the PBSS PB website which is www.bbsspb.org as you can see there I'll put a link in the description so now you want to go to downloads here so you want to scroll down to windows i know this this is windows file and there is the mac, the mac but we're gonna install the windows file and then we're gonna recognize it to uh, be uh, to run on the mac so all you want to do is basically just download any version you want of pbs as pb i recommend the the latest one which is 1.2.2 on my Mac uh, I actually recommend that if you if you want to install any other uh, version you can install it so after you install it you will get like a zip file like uh, it will just show like a zip file so basically you want to extract it and then you will get a file like this pbss pbss pb so uh, inside it you will find two uh, exe files one is named as bbss pb windows and the other one is uh, bbss pb windows 46 so you can choose either this one or this one to run the pbss pb the 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 the, 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 the two files are the same uh, the same app so now we're gonna be needing another app to uh, make that file that make that windows file run on the mac so you wanna go to wine butler uh, some of you may know that uh, program don't worry about it, like if, if it's saying wine or something like that it's just an app named like that so you wanna install that app and if you don't know what wine is wine is basically an app that uh, makes you run the windows files on the mac so like if you download any .exe f format file uh, you can just click on the file and then click uh, open with uh, with that uh, wine app and you can very easy run the uh, run the uh, uh, run the uh, .exe format file on a Mac so now you want to install this wine butler um, I actually recommend the stable one uh, I already installed it so I don't need to install it but don't worry I will I will put all the links in the description so you don't miss so you don't you don't forget these websites so now after you install that wine bottler of course you will get a .dmg file which is this one like this one so it will just be waited to verify and something like that then all you only need is to drag the wine bottler and the wine app to the applications I've already done that so I don't need to do it another time of course you need to put your password and your administration username so just like that actually now we, we will need the wine app we will not gonna need wine butler but you must install it because I think the wine will not work without the wine butler so yeah now after you install that that file uh, I mean that wine app you can very easy go on you know, the PBSS PB file that you have uh, uh, extracted from the uh, PBSS PB Windows zip file. So you want to click on your PBSS PB.exe, you want to click on Open With, and you want to click on Wine. So now it's it's it. You must wait some uh, some uh, some uh, sometimes to load the file. So just a minute. So it's it's basically gonna um, run the file. It's gonna say verifying wine or something like that. I already have done that, but uh, let's see now. I'm gonna done it another time. Okay, it may take some time. Um, yeah, 
uh, it should take some time actually but uh, but it uh, uh, in the end it will work so I think my file this file is not working so I recommend the next file I just rename it to bbssbb.exe but it's in another name so you just just as I told you click on open with then wine then it will shows like uh, uh, like a wearing thing just click open and then you uh, you you will notified by a by a box down there from wine just click on go and then the file will be, the file will be uh, uh, running running on your mac so like i've i've already done these steps so i'm going to open my bbssbb.exe and as you can see uh, my bbssbb is now running on the Mac and it is actually an a Windows file but it's fully working and everything is is good and uh, yeah I have already downloaded a game which is ca Crash Tag Team Racing one of the good games of, BB of PSP you can download it also um, if you want to download games you can actually go to a website called I don't know, know it but it's www.imparadise um, this this one in paradise dot me I will put also the uh, dot me uh, along the, yeah so I will put the link in the description so on this website you will need to go here to roms ISOs and games and click on that then you will here you will search for your game like I'm gonna type crash tag team racing you can you can search for your uh, name for your uh, uh, for your uh, game name, but uh, I I've already downloaded this game. But make sure that here it's saying PSP, not PS2 or any other uh, device. So like if I if, like I'm gonna choose this one here, you will see these icons. You wanna all you wanna just click on download links. Then here you will find this uh, this orange thing you click on it and then you will need you will click on this file so after after you click on this file the file will start download then you will get that raw file you also you obviously need to extract that file i've already extracted that game and i got this file so after you after you get that file of the game you may see that there is no any uh, iso or cso file so you want to scroll down till you see the form a uh, file formatted by rar not R r5 t or any other file you want to click on the this one rar file if if it if the i if the iso or the cso file is not located there if it's if it's already there you don't need to do that so some games have this rar file so you need to extract it after you extract it you will be you will be uh, uh, you'll be getting this file which is the iso file i've already done these here is you'll get this file formatted by iso so you wanna you wanna very easy go to that memstick or any or your desktop or any file I just located it in Memstech PSP, PSP game and use it. So yeah, and you want if you wanna navigate to this one, you know, when you start it, you will see like that. So when you want, when you put it on your desktop or any other uh, like any other file or something. So when you, first of all, you need to click on Z. That Z. Then you wanna click on users. Then uh, your username, uh, your username, the file. You want to click if it's located on desktop. You, you can do it like here in downloads any file. Like I'm locate my B. I located it in the BSB file here. So my BSB file in desktop. I click desktop. Then here BSB. Then memstick BSB game. And here is the game. So that's uh, that's it actually. That's how you can run. Uh, the uh, Windows Windows uh, that what that uh, I mean how how to get that BBSS BB emulator on the Mac and also you can uh, you can you can just try this wine app for any other .exe format file and you can run it on the Mac 
so yeah uh, hopefully you like video hopefully you uh, hopefully you uh, enjoyed that video and you discovered the new things about this thing and uh, please make subs subscribe and likes and uh, see you see you goodbye